and this is the E-Leaf I Just Start Kit. And this comes as a full complete kit. And supplied with one battery and one tank. If we lift off the foam layer, we're also supplied with a spare coil along with the one fitted inside the tank. an optional rem removable rubber airflow ring small set of instructions and a micro USB charging wire The battery itself is 1300 milliamp capacity, operates with just a single button, charges via the side micro USB charging port, which does allow vaping while the device is charging, and a standard 510 connection. The tank will hold 2 mils of e-liquid, it's made of glass, it's a plastic removable mouthpiece, and slits at the bottom on either side for your airflow. And combined with the rubber airflow ring, you can restrict the draw to how you like it. Again, this is completely optional. If you don't like it, you don't need to use it. In order to fill the tank and to access the coil, we'll turn it upside down and we'll unscrew the base. Here we've got our coil, our atomizer head, and our tank. In order to fill the tank, you want to miss the hole in the centre, as it will run out your mouthpiece. Tilt the tank to the side, and allow the juice to flow in the slits in either side of the tank. With your base here, you have your atomizer head. When this does go, which is usually around about two-ish weeks, to replace the unit, all you need to do is give it a good pinch and unscrew. This particular coil that they give you is 0 0.75 ohms, and replacement coils are available on the website. So you'll get a new coil. We'll screw it back into the base. Nice and tight. And we're ready to go. If we have put a new coil on here, you'll always want to put a few drops in each of the slit. Just to slightly prime it, and give it a wee head start wicking your e-liquid. Once you've filled your tank, We'll screw the base back on and we're ready to put it onto our battery now.
to turn the device on, we click the button five times. And we can see it's lit up and flashed at us so we know that it's acknowledged it and it's working. To operate it, it's very simple. You'll simply push the button and hold it as you take your draw and release when you're done.